Storm clouds in the sky and a seal on the beach. We could fill 15 minutes with just photographs of those things that you sent us this week. Yeah, but we all know we don't have 15 minutes to do that. But what we do have is a jam-packed reporter recap. This past week in Connecticut has been anything but boring. In fact, as you showed us in your photos and videos, it was quite the opposite. We'll start with the weather, which put on a show. That's great video from Marcy of the whipping wind at Coventry Lake. Sam shot some video of the hail falling in Northford, and many more of you from Beacon Falls to Wallingford sent photos. But it was your pictures of the dramatic clouds that really got our attention. They moved in Monday night, darkening the skies over Connecticut before dumping in many places plenty of rain. And we'd be remiss if we didn't show you these rather unique and frightening formations spotted from Southbury and Newtown on Friday. Now, when the storms were done, we got a visual treat in the form of some beautiful and clearly defined rainbows and double rainbows, followed by a gorgeous sunset that was prettier than a painting. The sudden shifts from good to bad and back were captured perfectly in these multi-frame montages from Brian and Aaliyah. All the rain left the rivers running fast in several spots of flooding, though this flooding Wednesday in West Haven was man-made, albeit accidentally, when a truck hit a fire hydrant. You helped us cover breaking news early Thursday morning, sending pictures from New Haven where a vehicle flipped and hit a gas station, killing two men. You were also in Madison to help us report it when a fire did some significant damage downtown. Over the weekend, you shared shots from the Brantford Road Race and Brantford Festival, which seemed to feature an alien invasion. You showed us Living History Day at Fort Trumbull and real living history as Joe and Marjorie both turned 100. There were families celebrating Father's Day, sports teams celebrating championships, and kids celebrating the end of kindergarten. Finally, one of the more photogenic seals you'll ever see, spending Wednesday in West Haven on the beach. This little guy attracted quite a crowd and seemed to pose for every picture. Did say it was crazy.